I am leaving the EAS community and I will never return. <clears throat> you know why? Because there's too many assholes in the community. I made a community post a few months ago uh, stating that I was going to leave the community because it had gone to shit. But I felt like making a video expressing my thoughts on the community and how I personally believe it's beyond hope. It was really Nova and Saren's videos that really solidified my decision to leave the community, especially Nova's. He made like a two hour long video addressing the community and you know, them obviously not caring. I mean, if there's anything to summarize this community, it is nothing but, uh, it is not a community at all. A community is a place where people help each other and care about each other. This is no community at all. It's just a cesspool of racism, predatory behavior, doxing, harassment, arguments, and all that shit. A bunch of fucking grown-ass adults have the audacity to harass a minor for years. Fucking years. Like, what? How in the fuck do these grown-ass adults have nothing better to do with their lives? Like, how is that possible? You could go out with friends or do anything, yet you choose to fucking harass minors on Discord for years. That is fucking disgraceful and pathetic. It, it, not only is that just fucked up to do to a minor anyway, but, you know, it's pathetic. These guys have nothing better to do in their lives. I don't get why. I mean, Nova has tried to do good for the community, and this is what he gets in return. A bunch of fucking ungrateful, immature, grown adults. They're not even adults if they're this immature anyway. Not to mention there's been several predators in the community, of course. Clay being one example. I used to support his content. I used to enjoy laughing at him and how, quite frankly, over the top he could get. I used to think he was a decent person, but not anymore. And, you know, the fact that I just hesitated to switch away from him as soon as he laughed at Nova getting doxxed, that's... I feel ashamed of myself for that. I mean, that should have been a definitive point of him being guilty of his actions. But I think it was because I didn't know the full extent of what happened. But still, doing that shit to a minor is fucked up. And these people are only pretending like they care when some of them actually are the ones that fucking assisted in the doxing of Nova and him being sent NSFW content. Like, why the fuck would you do that to a minor? That just shows you how fucking low this community is. I mean, there's fucking guilt tripping, harassment, predatory behavior, racism. I mean, not only was Clay a racist piece of shit as well as a predator, um, Easy West was also the same guy. I mean, well, Easy West was the same type of person. He was a predator, and he was also a racist. And there's been several racist people in that community as well. I'm just thinking that leaving this community will, will be better for my mental health. Because immersing myself in a world of hatred and violence, it's not going to do me any good. It's not. Yes, it's wise to be aware of the risks that come on the internet, but... 
You know, immersing yourself in a world of hatred and violence is not going to do you any better. But this community has gone down the fucking drain, man, for real. I mean, <clears throat> how do these grown adults have nothing better to do than fucking do this shit online? I mean, I didn't even know that Nova was the victim of harassment, uh, scapegoating, and guilt tripping for four ye for several years, at least four years. That is a fucking disgrace. And you got one of the uh, bigger creators in the community, EASS, fucking also guilt tripping and gaslighting Nova and having his uh, having his supporters attack Nova as well. I mean, I used to remain neutral towards him. I watched his video on Clay Ranger 143. Now looking back at it, 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 seeing what EA Sess did, it really makes me think that he only made his video on Clay just to try and look like the good guy. There's a lot of people in this community that only pretend like they care when they really don't. It's only when they get called out on their bullshit that they fucking apologize. But you know what? You should not have done that shit in the first place. So, this community is just full of terrible people and I can no longer bear to be in it. Will I still do EAS captures? Absolutely, because that's what I enjoy the most. Something I've enjoyed since 2015, and that's, that's the year when I joined the community. Never in my eight years of being in the community did I think it would devolve this low, but it has. And I'm just gonna leave and be an independent EAS fan, still doing EAS captures, but remaining away from any major events in the community. What this will mean, however, is no more EAS scenarios, obviously, because, I mean, you know, those are a major thing in the EAS community, and besides, I can't even write them for shit. I might do short mocks or whatever, but, you know, that's it. That's it. I can no longer stand to watch this community just crumble. And I have a feeling it has no hope for changing, considering its years-long history of people being terrible in this community. Predatory behavior, doxing, racism, people faking their deaths. Look at SSTAAS. He fucking faked suicide and then came back, only to be exposed for predatory behavior and sentenced to 15 years in prison for it. Something tells me that he faked his death to try and get away with it. He might have done it years before. But you have fucking people faking their deaths, doxing other people, being racist motherfuckers, um, preying on minors. It's just a fucked up mess that's been going on for years. And because it's been going on for years, I really don't think this community will ever change. And, you know, the sad part is... The, the, these are grown-ass adults doing this. And, you know, how they have nothing better to do than to fucking commit terrible acts online is just baffling to me. Like, how it's possible is beyond me. But it really makes me believe that they will never be functioning members of society. I mean, if they're gonna act this fucking immature and never change then they will never be good people in society they will never be functioning members in society that's one of the saddest parts of this community right now it's just a fucked up mess that i don't want to be in anymore 
It's time for me to move on and control my own destiny. It's time for me to do my own things. And let my mental health get better. Because I don't want to be turning into a keyboard warrior and a hater. Because I, I want to look myself in the mirror as a good person in society. I want to be a good person. And I fear that this might be a dark path. If I just keep immersing myself in a world of bad people. And that's why I feel that it is necessary to leave. Because if I stay, it might turn me into a bad person as well. And I don't want that. I appreciate you guys sticking with me for the past eight years now. That's pretty much all I have to say, people. I appreciate you guys watching. Thank you.